Hi and welcome back to another Endless Tech video. Today we are going to upgrade this 12-year-old laptop by adding an SSD and RAM. This used to be my very own laptop for school but I stopped using it a couple years back due to it being very slow in the upgrading, and it has been piling dust ever since. It is now needed again by someone who also needs it for school work, hence the upgrades. The laptop came with a 160GB hard drive, an Intel Celeron Dual Core T3 101GB of RAM, which are definitely laughable specs for today's standards. But with a couple of cheap upgrades we can have a decent laptop by the end of it. I will talk more about prices further on in the video but first of all let's do a speed test on how long this laptop takes to boot. The laptop took 1 minute and 28 seconds to boot up, definitely not the fastest of laptops, and that was only with 4 applications installed onto the system. Now to make this a fair test I will install the same 4 apps on the new operating system for the speed test comparison after the upgrades. As you can see in this new clip trying to go into system specs the laptop nearly took 2 and a half minutes, and Chrome refused to open or open 5 minutes later. This laptop is very frustrating to use and is basically unusable so let's get into the upgrades and prices. For the first upgrade we are going with the 120GB Kingston A400 SSD. This is a very popular and fast SSD and will definitely speed up the boot time of the laptop. And the best thing about it is the price. I got this one on eBay for £10 or $11. These are going very cheap and are definitely worth the price. Highly recommend it. With the second upgrade we are going with 2x2GB PC2-6400S RAM sticks which gives us a total of 4GB of RAM. These are also going very cheap. I got these sticks for £5 or $6 from Facebook Marketplace but on eBay they are going for 10 to £12 or 11 to $14. Again a very cheap upgrades. And this will be a very noticeable difference in the system considering we only have 1GB of RAM right now. So altogether I have spent £15 or $17 on upgrades. Let's install them into the system and see if it was worth it.
For the operating system we are going with Windows 10 Home 64-bit. This is the exact OS I had on the hard drive. Now with the system up to date and with all the applications installed, let's test the laptop's performance out now. As you can see, before it took around two and a half minutes just to get into system specs, and now it does it in seconds. It's the same story with Chrome, before Chrome just refused to open or would open five minutes later, and now it also does it in a couple of seconds. Applications like Microsoft Word and PowerPoint are now a joy to use, as you don't have to wait two minutes for them to open. I think the upgrades were really worth it, especially for the price. This laptop now has new life and is definitely usable again in 2022. Most certainly want game but for daily use like browsing the internet or making documents and doing homework this laptop can now deliver. The difference of the laptop's performance is night and day and I would recommend you guys to do it, as the main motive of this video was to show you that. If you have any old laptops or computers don't just throw them away because by investing a little it could make a big difference. Now, for the time you have all been waiting for, the boot speed test. Wow, what an improvement, that was one minute faster, very happy with the results, I hope you have enjoyed the video, if you did please like and subscribe, until next time, take care.